Hey yo everybody, Fred Charles here, and in this video we are going to enter the world of Coffee Quest. Now before we begin, I do not endorse the overindulgence in coffee, or even drinking coffee grad casually, especially if you are young, because that is dangerous for you. That being said, I have absolutely no idea what to expect from this game. I don't even know how to play this game. I forgot. I did download this last night, but I don't know if you follow my Twitter, some people do, some people don't, but I do update my status on Twitter a lot, and I do like to tell you guys when I'm about to upload a video, when I'm not about to upload a video, and last night was one of those nights when I actually really couldn't upload a video. I mean, I could have made one, but it would have been terrible quality. Anyway, the reason why I'm playing this game is because Grim Yaz, another YouTuber, actually recommended it to me, and he said, hey, Prud Charles, you're going to laugh so much when you watch this, so... I am going to do a challenge. I'm going to try not to laugh at this game, even though I'm already... Oh gosh, there I go, I lost. Nadrix. Okay, starting from now, I'm not going to laugh at this game. I play this game a lot with other people. Like, we put on funny, funny YouTube videos, and then we try not to laugh, right? So, we're going to do that with this game. Let's begin. Meeting room. Work harder. Nice signs already. It's almost time for the daily progress meeting. I won't be able to stay awake. I need to get myself a cup of coffee first. Man, Bob, what a mediocre name. Oh, it's a point and click game. Awesome, that'll be easy. Okay, so, hmm, meeting room, work harder. I guess we'll go to the a motivational poster. That wasn't a laugh, by the way. That was a, a chuckle in my voice. See, man, it's really hard to be sad. Senior management are really encouraging. Yep, they are. It's a very clear sign pointing in the direction of the meeting room. Senior management hated if we're late for meetings. They don't want us to miss out. I can't do this. Why have you done this to me, Grimyaz? I've actually mentioned Grimyaz in another of my video in another of my videos. Senior management took the batteries out of the clock, so we wouldn't have to worry about how late we're working. Wow, that's terrible. That's really bad. They really care about our mental well-being. No, they don't. I'm not laughing. Senior management like to keep our morale up. Smile, you're here forever. I think this game is a really good wake-up call. That wasn't a laugh. Hey Bob, how's it going, friend? I'm tired, I'm bored, or I'm thirsty. If you're thirsty, you won't be going for coffee because coffee makes you thirsty. That is a fact, it dehydrates you. So, I'm going to say I'm bored. I'm bored. I hear you, buddy. You need something to entertain you. Well, I have just a thing for you. I'm going to tell you all about my exotic stamp collection. No thanks. No thanks. I need to get my coffee. Wow, that makes me feel sad, Bob. That makes me feel real sad. Sorry, Steve. I just, I, I cannot stand. Oh, maybe we should go back to Steve. Maybe we should go back to Steve. I, I can't get back to Steve. Cubicle farm? Not going back there until I have my coffee. Oh, well, we missed out on the exotic stamp collection. Let's go to the kitchen. That's probably where all the coffee is. Fridge. There's a note on the fridge. Please put the milk back in the fridge after you're finished with it. Thanks. Really nice note. Oh, I didn't, I didn't see that one. Come to the cubicle farm on floor one to sign Steve's condolences card. For what? Please bring any donations to the orphan charity to the storage cupboard on the third floor. Really? What? Why? Help me. Oh. It's a picture of a dog or a squid or something. Are they all the same? Okay, it's recycling. So what's the second one? Whoever's been stealing my mug, if you do it again, oh, it'll be the last straw. Alright, whatever. Coffee machine. I can't make coffee without coffee beans. Where are the- oh, here? Tasty coffee beans. Oh, they're spelt really appropriately. My favorite brand of coffee beans. Tasty beans, 100% ingredients. Okay, let's get Keith's mug. This is Keith's mugs, but who really, who really cares? All right, we need a mug. Yeah, he won't mind if we borrow it, even though it says, don't borrow it on it. Don't use it, I mean. I refuse to drink coffee without milk. What? Somebody left the milk out of the fridge. Such laziness. Let's get the sweetener too. He probably wants it. Are you serious? Okay, where's the sugar then? Where is the sugar? Does he demand sugar? Okay, he needs sugar. Management locked the sugar away to combat... Office obesity. I'll have to go to the storage cupboard on the third floor to get it. Are you serious? He's going to go all the way to the third floor with all these supplies. I would be so embarrassed if this was me. 
Okay, safe code. Pens and spam hugs. Spam mugs. I'm not laughing. I can't open the sugar safe without a secret sugar safe combination. Matches. You never know when you might need a box of matches. Alright, is it here? Oh, the safe combination is right there. That's not very safe at all. That's actually pretty dangerous. Although it's just sugar. Maybe lighting a match will make it easier to see the combination. Whoops. Oh, that was smart. I guess I'll need to get the safe combination somewhere else. The janitor should know it. Okay. I only use fountain pens. He He's a very picky guy, this guy. I'm happy with Key Smug. I don't need to take another one. Is he serious? Key Smug says, like, don't use it on it. Okay, janitor's dwelling. We have to see the janitor. It's like the last step in our quest. The coffee quest. Wow, everything has a face. Have you noticed the safe had a face as well? And now this... I'm not sure what that is. A boiler? Hello. Hello. I need the combination for the sugar safe so I can make my coffee sweet. It's no use. I'll need to make a really loud noise to wake him. Well, let's go to old Betsy. Old Betsy's got the solution. The company boiler. Just looking at her makes me think of all the good times we've had. What? Why? Why? Still not laughing. I promise. I've always wanted a giant red wrench. So did I. Okay, let's do something with the red wrench on Betsy. Hitting old Betsy with the boiler with my newfound wrench should wake the janitor up. Should there be sound for this game? Because I'm not hearing any sound. Eh, who? What's that? Janitor. Sir, I'm on an important quest to get the combination for the secret sugar safe. Oh yes, that's an easy one. The combination is combination. I'm pretty sure that's not how safes work. Yeah, it's pretty numbers, right? Well, what would I know, right? I'm just a janitor. Okay, janitor, Mr. Useful. I've got nothing more to say to him. I've already got the combination to the safe. What? Is it literally? Is it really? Oh gosh, I don't want to go back to the janitor. Is it actually combination? I didn't know safes work like that. Oh dear, the fire seems to have spread. It's none of my concern. I'm sure the sprinklers will kick in soon. Uh, right, wouldn't they have kicked in by now? At last, I've got some sugar. Now I can go back to the kitchen to make an acceptable cup of coffee. Alright, that was a really weird puzzle, but okay, let's go back to the kitchen, make this coffee, get all happy. Uh-oh, an angry note. Somebody stuck a note on the wall. I warned you not to take my mug. Huh? First world problems. What's gonna happen when we have this coffee? I am worried now. I am really worried. Victory. I've got a cup of coffee with all the necessary ingredients. It feels so good in my hands. I think I'm ready to face that meeting now. I'll need to go back through the cubicle farm. Uh-oh. Is Keith his boss? I hope it's not his boss. Because he's going to be in trouble. What's this? Somebody stuck a note on the cubicle wall. I'm so lonely. I just needed someone to talk to. I wonder who could have written that. What? Why would they? Why would anybody... In this wonderful job. Write something like that. Okay, let's keep going. The meeting room's over here. Wow, he's angry. Gentlemen, welcome to the daily progress meeting. Thank you to everybody who signed Steve's condolences card. He's in need of our support. Unfortunately, some inconsiderate person upset him today and he suffered a mental breakdown. What? Emotional trauma. Get better soon, Steve. What? Just because I didn't want to see his exotic stamp collection? Are you kidding me? Drink. If anyone sees Keith from the IT department, please call the police. Do not approach him under any circumstances. He's gone on a murderous rampage because some a-hole had the nerve to steal his mug. Petty theft. Several casualties. Number one, Keith. Okay. I'm, I'm just nonchalantly drinking from the cup that's on the screen, like in a widescreen projector. As I'm sure you're all aware, today we are due to transfer the proceeds of our collection to the orphan charity. It pains me to say that the collection has been lost in a tragic storage cupboard fire. Charity drive ruined arson. Mug supply god. This is so... not funny. Wrench theft. The sprinklers were unable to respond because some monster hurt old Betsy, taking out the entire plumbing system in the process. Oh no. I put too much sugar in my coffee. Is this guy for real? <laughs> Thank you so... Thank you for playing Coffee Quest. And credits. This was a really good game.
<laughs> the loot and dare jam. Okay. The reason why I'm struggling not to laugh here is because the loot and dare jam for this year, loot and dare jam is a game jam, right? Where people have to create a game within 72 hours. And the theme for this year was you are the monster. So this whole game was about you being a huge monster. Dude. <laughs> I didn't laugh. That This game is like, even though I actually really tried hard not to laugh, but this game is so funny. So funny. And it's made so simply as well. I didn't hear any music. Maybe that was intentional. Wait. There is audio. So maybe I just um, messed up my earphones or something. So I hope you heard that those sounds that played. But I thought this was awesome. The art style was simple. It was like watercolor images or something. But it really fit in with the point and click style. So that was great. I, I'm not used to point and click games that actually work. So good on you for getting it to work. I haven't played a point and click game that works since like Frambo and Five Nights at Freddy's. So awesome, awesome, awesome job on that. I wish I could hear the audio though so I could critique that because I really like when audio is implemented in these games, but I'm sure it was good too. The writing was phenomenal. <laughs> it wasn't like Shakespearean or anything, but you have a really good sense of comedy. So please like make more comedic games because we need more funny games out there. If you could make a funny horror game, that would be awesome because I would definitely play that. But you know, horror might not be your thing. That's okay. Stuff like this. This Coffee Quest game was actually pretty funny and fulfilling. And with that said, thank you so much for watching, everybody. Thank you, Grimyaz, for recommending this game. And I'll see you soon. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoy content like this. Once again, I hope you enjoyed this video. Check out my channel for more videos like this. And I'll see you next time. See ya!